In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Novena to St. Paul, Day 7, January 31st. Glorious St. Paul, through the blinding light of Christ, you were converted from being a persecutor of the Christian name to being its most zealous apostle. To make Jesus our divine Savior, known to the uttermost parts of the earth, you suffered prisons, scourgings, stoning shipwreck, and all manner of persecutions, and shed the last drop of your blood. Obtain for us the grace to accept the infirmities, sufferings, and misfortunes of this life as favors of the divine mercy. So may we never grow weary of the trials of our exile, but rather show ourselves ever more faithful and fervent. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. for the elderly and vulnerable members of our parish. Ardent convert, St. Paul, at your conversion you were blinded for a time by our Lord, and during that time of vulnerability your heart was converted by the Holy Spirit. Pray to the Lord our God for the elderly and most vulnerable of our parish. Through their infirmities may they be drawn closer to the most sacred heart of Jesus and feel his tender love for them. May we come to see Jesus in the most vulnerable members of our parish, especially the elderly, sick, and unborn. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. With St. Paul, we praise God our Father, to him be the glory in the church and in Christ, now and forever. Amen. Sacred Heart of Jesus, grant us sorrow for our sins. Holy Spirit, the paraclete, guide us to holiness. God the Father, have mercy on us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.